how to take a combined throat and nose swab. To test for coronavirus SARS-CoV-2, we need a combined sample from your throat and nose using both nostrils. This swab is commonly taken by doctors and nurses, but you can take the sample safely yourself. It would be helpful if you do the swab in front of a mirror. The kit contains everything you will need. Wash your hands carefully before opening the kit and unpacking on a clean surface. Ensure when washing your hands that you do so for 20 seconds, thoroughly washing your fingers, palms, the outer surfaces of your hands and your wrists before rinsing. The kit shown is for demonstration purposes. Colours of the elements may vary. Please follow the instruction leaflet in your own kit. Do not open the swab packet until you are ready to swab your mouth. In the box you will find the following items. A request form requiring your name, address, postcode, date of birth and NHS number. A swab and a tube with liquid in. This is a special liquid which keeps the viruses from the swab preserved. Please do not throw away this liquid. Screw top container which is used to transport the samples. There will be an instruction sheet containing similar steps as outlined within this video. It will contain a plastic envelope, one with either writing on it, for a postal version, or with no writing, and this is the courier version. No stamp is required. Here is a graphic showing the included kit. Request form and instruction sheet. Plastic envelope. Swab in packet. Tube with liquid in. A screw topped container. You can now remove the instruction form from your pack and follow the instructions outlined in this video. Feel free to pause the video at any point. Open the swab packet which contains the single swab in a tube. Only remove the swab by the stick end. Do not touch the swab tip. Write your name and the date of the sample on the outside label of the smaller tube. Now using the swab, take your throat sample. Stand in front of a mirror. Wipe the soft tip of the swab around the back of the throat as shown. Open your mouth wide and stick out your tongue. You will see an arch at the back of your mouth. Try to swipe the soft tip of the swab across the very back of your throat behind the arch. Ensure that you swab the sides of the arch where your tonsils protrude to. You should not swab your tongue or teeth if possible. Note, this process may make you gag but should not be painful. Now, place the tip of the cotton swab just inside your nostril and gently wipe around the inside of the nose. No force is needed and you do not have to push far into your nostril. Please repeat this for your other nostril. Once you have taken the swab, carefully open the tube with the liquid, unscrewing the cap and putting the swab tip first into the tube and breaking off the plastic end as shown. The breaking point is marked midway along the stick where it is thinner. Once it is broken, replace the top of the tube with the lid. Place the small clear tube with the swab inside into the larger screw topped container and then screw the lid of the larger container closed. Check the form has your correct name, address, postcode, date of birth and NHS number. Please write the date of the sample and the time of the sample on the request form. Put the folded request form inside the box alongside the larger container. You can now securely close and seal the box. Now wash your hands carefully with soap and water. Place the box in the envelope and seal. The envelope may or may not be addressed depending on the type of delivery service used. Note. 
If your kit has been supplied by a dedicated courier delivery service, please return the completed sample kit to the courier. If your kit is a postal version, post the envelope in the local post box. If you have developed symptoms or believe you may be at risk of infection, contact a friend or neighbour by phone and ask them to collect the envelope from outside your door. This is so that you don't risk passing the infection on to them. If you cannot find someone to help, then one family member or friend or neighbour should go to the nearest post box. Thank you for completing your combined nose and throat swab kit. For current guidance on self-isolation, please visit nhs.uk. Search for self-isolation advice for coronavirus.